Hey guys and welcome back to our channel. So we are doing a new video on the channel. It's going to be a 10 minute clean with me. Kind of like a 10 minute cleaning motivation video. You guys can use this video not only for motivation but also a timer to tidy up your home. That is exactly what I'm doing. This was right after the kids finished their lunch so I had some wiping down to do, wiping down the high chair, a ton of dishes, you guys will see that soon, and wiping off the counters, cleaning off the counters, picking stuff off the floor, you name it. I feel like lunch is kind of like our rush hour. There's just so much going on around that time. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. Again, I hope it will give you guys some cleaning motivation, and thank you guys so much for watching. you guys so I made the mistake of not running the dishwasher the night before so do you guys ever forget that you have a full dishwasher and then you go to do dishes and you realize when you opened it that you never ran the dishes and you just have to stuff as many things as you can which is exactly what I'm doing I'm trying to put as many cups and plates as I can in this dishwasher and actually I ended up having to hand wash a lot of um, Scarlet's things which I usually do anyways so note to self always run the dishwasher even if it's not completely full go ahead and run the dishwasher Brittany because it's been so crazy with the kids being at home how many dishes will pile up in just one day or even just one meal I find myself doing dishes at least three times a day and running the dishwasher every single night which we didn't have to before but um, it makes me wish that sometimes I had two dishwashers or a bigger dishwasher or even at least a dishwasher that will wash dishes a lot faster I was actually thinking the other day I kind of wish I had two wa washer and dryers as well because that would make laundry go by 10 times faster actually I just thought that through never mind because then it would take me twice as long to put the laundry up So the next thing that I am tackling is our island. I've talked about this before. Our island is our catch-all for our downstairs. It's like where everything ends up. And then like the medium to that is the stairs. That's like the second catch-all. And then our bedroom is the third catch-all. So just putting some stuff away in our junk drawer. I know I showed you guys a couple weeks ago that we cleaned that and it's almost back to how it was the first time. My dad actually has sent us some masks to use, which I never thought I would ever have to say that. You know, I have like a little stash of medical masks in my kitchen because of these crazy times. It's just, it's still, it's still so crazy to me. Um, but I just pick everything up and let me know if you guys also do this in your house. You clean up one area, but everything else kind of gets shovels to another area. So. I kind of like secretly put some stuff in the office to hide it um, but I am now just wiping off the counters which I do at least three times a day as well now <laughs> It 
was so cute while I was wiping down our uh, back door Scarlett tried to slip behind me she loves going outside and any chance that she can if the door is open she will try to go outside she loves it so much and then she even was like picking up some of my empty spray bottles and pretending to clean too which I, I just had to film that really quick even though it's not part of cleaning but super cute regardless So I did have a little bit of help. I cheated a little bit with this 10 minute clean with me. I decided to turn on our robo, robo, <laughs> robot vacuum. I, I could not, I use that thing every single day just to help pick up crumbs and everything. I actually had plans to mop the floor. So while I was cleaning the rest of the things, I turned it on that way it would go ahead and vacuum everything up and I would be good to go with vacuuming but other things that I needed to get done I needed to of course clean the living room which you guys will see and Scarlett has officially learned how to take these little mat tiles up so now we've been like playing puzzles with it every single day um, but some other things that you guys will see here in a second that I need to do was clean up our mud room like kind of like tidy it up and organize it I had to tidy up our entryway and take a whole bunch of boxes to the garage and also I refilled Luna's uh, food container. So the last thing on my to-do list was to mop all of our wood floor. Instead of using our smart vacuum, because it also has a mopping attachment, I noticed that if the cloth gets really dirty or if you use it a few times, it leaves streaks on the floor. I love it, but just after a while, I notice it will do that. So I'm just going to use my Bona mop, spray mop, and I sometimes like using this a little bit more. I feel like it cleans a little bit better than the vacuum or the mop on the vacuum. Um, it definitely leaves our floors the shiniest. So if you guys have wood floors, I definitely recommend. I eventually want to get like a steam cleaner, like a steam mop, I think, for the wood floors. I always get questions about our hardwood floors. So they're not true hardwood, hard, I cannot talk in this video. They're not true hardwood, they're engineered hardwood. So yes, they do have wood in it but it's not like you know old-fashioned hardwood floors um, so with that being said I am a little nervous to use a steam mop on it just because I've heard like it can warp the wood or mess it up so if you guys also have engineered hardwood and use a steam mop let me know what you guys think if you like it if you don't like it um, leave those in the comments down below but that is going to be it for our 10 minute clean with me cleaning motivation video i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope it gave you guys motivation to clean your house as well that's why i love doing these videos i love to be able to help you guys out get you motivated get you inspired and we appreciate you guys 
watching our videos. Thank you guys so much and we will see you in our next one.